right, so I'm about two hours away from the concrete showing up. I've got everything prepped, I've got rebar in place, I've got all the verticals ready to go. Um, it should be somewhere around a six or eight yard pour is my hope, but I went a little wide in some spots, so I'm okay with that. I'm um, doing things a little bit different in the sense that I am using a mix on site truck instead of a ready mix truck uh, because um, he's cheaper, number one, and also there's this idea that where I'm at, the location where I'm at, it's, it's the mud's getting warm by the time the guys are, or, or concrete trucks are getting up here. Uh, they're coming from about 45 minutes away, but uh, anyway, um, I've never worked with a, uh, a mixed truck like this, but I'm sure it'll be fine. We're just putting footings down, nothing too major. Um, we'll see how she goes.
the footings poured. Nice, wide, deep footings. Uh, tomorrow I'll come and strip the little bit of forms that I use just to kind of keep them from washing out. <clears throat> I'll strip those forms tomorrow. And I will bend the rebar over. Well, I won't bend the rebar over until um, I find grade in here. I'm gonna need to add uh, quite a bit of fill in here in the back part of this. Um, there's about a five inch difference to, from one side to the other. And then we'll set forms and get the uh, concrete port hopefully um, fairly soon. I talked to the, the guy that delivered the concrete today and he's ready when I'm ready. So.